Hey guys, welcome back to how to build the F-15. Uh, I was already working on this thing and I thought I had the camera on and I guess the, the battery on it run, run out or something and, and I didn't record any of this work right here. But I mean, it's basically just sending, all this is just sending work. You know, the more time you put into this kind of stuff right, right now, the more nicer your jet is going to look. Uh, this is the piece that we left off the last video. Uh, as you remember, it was a square. Basically, what I did, I uh, grabbed my knife, and after I marked those two, you know, those lines here on both sides, just cut it with a knife and cut both edges again. And the same thing in this side, cut the first one and then the other two, and just start sending around. And the nose is the same thing. As you see it here, I already have it done too. Uh, I'm sorry guys, but I, I I didn't realize that that thing went off on me. Uh, I did the same thing with the cockpit. I still have to do some more thing on the cockpit though. Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and do it. Yeah, I don't know what happened, but that thing went off. <laughs> okay. As you see here, all you have to, to, to do is try to mold the shape of the cockpit. You just have to be very patient. I mean, you have to have a lot of patience for the for if you want to get a good, nice look on this kind of piece right here. I think I'm just going to leave it like that. As you see it right here. You can see the shape of the cockpit now. And this is going to be on this guy. It's going to be sitting here. Now I'm going to put the pieces over here. I'm going to put about three pieces. Uh, you know, this right here. But I'm going to cut it the size of this. And I'm going to stop three in there so we can get a tick. Because we're going to send that, all this nose to the shape of this nose right here. And we're gonna be doing the same thing on the bottom. It's gonna be something like this. So let's keep working on it. Hey guys, uh, this is what I'm gonna work now. It's gonna be the bottom of the jet. But I'm gonna be showing you just pictures of it because the time on it, you know. But I basically, I just wanted to show you what I'm going to be doing, you know. You're going to see it on the pictures, but just to be more more clear with you. I'm going to be cutting this right here, this edge right here. I'm going to cut it off. I'm going to, as you see, I already cut this piece right here. and already bend it. And what I'm going to do, you know, it's going to be glued here and here. But I'm going to put a more of an arch into it, more bend on it. And it's only shortened to that point because I'm going to redo the whole tail. To make the you know for the exhaust over there so uh, basically the way I bend this piece right here is just with this piece of wood that you see right here uh, what I do let me see if I can get this thing over here so I can show you uh. okay uh, so what I do just grab the piece of wood and you know like everybody probably does this this, this tool up there too you know just Grab it and bend until you get the shape of it. Just roll it back and forth, back and forth through the whole thing until you start getting that shape. And you know, just cut this thing as needed. All right, guys, let's keep working on this thing. Okay, guys, now that we have this back done. See, you can see both of them. You just grab a piece of wood or whatever and get some paper on it. Just like this. Yeah. As tight as possible. And as you can see right there, we have both already on place. So we just go now. I'll put this upside down with the nose down. Uh, 
Okay. Let's see what we got. See right there now we we make this to look just like one piece all the way around here. And now what we do to blend everything together is keep sending here to make it more brown. There we go, now we have both of them blending in with each other. Both sides. So right there. I, I'm, I'm still going to cut this this right here, the front of it, so it will look just like that. You know, so you, what you can see is just that round part right there. We have to cut about an inch into in here. Alright guys, let's keep working on this thing. Hey guys. Uh, basically now what we're gonna do see it here we have the carpet I already glued this piece over here and this one over here and you notice I put three pieces right here and one on the side the reason why I did this, this so thick is because there is where, where I'm gonna be hooking my toothpicks the you know the one we're gonna put on the front of this nose they're gonna hook right there so basically what we're gonna do now is gonna be send cut this and send it and to shape, you see the square? We're gonna shape all this with the nose. We're gonna make the cockpit and the nose, all this blend together. All right, let's do it. Hey guys, this is the point where we decide if we want to just go ahead and paint it and or keep adding more details. Uh, it's all right to fly, I mean, you see it flies very nice, so you can just go ahead and paint your jet or you can wait <laughs> and see what else we're gonna do to it because we're gonna be adding the shoulder blades in here, we're gonna be adding, you know, the, the to simulate the turbines over there. And, it's gonna be looking very nice as you see the nice blend all this is going is blending and then the back of the cut will blend nice and neat too you see right there also the bottom right here as you can see i got all that nice scent too going right there i already cut this little piece right here and there i haven't cut that one but i need to cut it so it will look just like that you see it right there and how did you like that Cessna that just flew by a while ago? <laughs> uh, I live co close to the airport and also close to the close to the Air Force base, so I get a bunch of airplanes flying over here. Uh, sometimes, whenever they are on training or whatever, uh, I see this F-15 taking off. The Air Force is just right straight in that line, so I get them taking off. They go just right above my house, and also you know them cargo planes. So I'm putting up together a, a bunch of pictures that I've been taking here in my backyard. So I'm gonna show them to you pretty soon. Whenever I get enough of them, I'm gonna upload them to show you all the airplanes that I've been taking pictures of just right here from my backyard. <laughs> okay guys, that's it for today. Thank you for watching.